Well, I promise I do it. So it's time. I'm gonna be going over some projects that I had planned, but they were ultimately canceled. So let's get on with it. First canceled project I had planned, I'm gonna do it in order I've had these projects planned. So we're gonna start off with The Adventures at LSU Book, episode six. So back before my channel was terminated, I did do a series called The Adventures at LSU Book. It's basically inspired off of a bunch of things like inanimate fight out and I mean, hence one part of the title of the series. It was also based around Cannon Duck, which is an Angry Birds bootleg that we all know and love. Or hate, since it's a bootleg. But for those wondering what the episode's going to be about, LSU Book, The Sharpeners, Headband, TNT, and Globe would all enter the... You know, they would enter some red area with a bunch of fire and lava everywhere. It was like, like the nether from Minecraft. But... The reason the episode was canceled along with the rest of the series, I was able to get at least the first five episodes done. But I might do a reboot with the same cast and same thing and all that. So. That is the first one. Let's move on to the second one. So the next project I have is yet another Canceled Object Show episode. Because unlike with the Adventures of LSU book, whereas this is more of an adventure series rather than an actual object show. But imagine that. But it's set with an adventure. Object Awakening is going to be a mix of both. It was going to be both an adventure object show and a competition show at the same time. With the main host of Object Awakens being an axe. It was heavily based on Object Madness that was developed by Brian. That show, just like this show, only had two episodes. I'm going to explain some things that went down for episode episode three for mine. Well, let's recap everything that went on. So, first eliminated contestant. The challenge was basically a boss battle. Yeah, like I said, this show is mainly going to be about boss battles. And they're going to fight off various creatures and and what stuff. And whichever team would defeat the boss would actually win. And the other team lost, so so team so team 2 lost again. But not much is really known outside of that. So, there's that going for it. Let's just move on to the next. All right, next cancel project. I was going to do a little puppet movie of HTF, but like I said, this one's probably going to have the quickest explanation. Like I said, hardly any production even went on. But like I said, it was low budget as hell, so... But the reason I scrapped it, it's because looking up on the wiki, there was actually supposed to be an HTF movie. But the current status of that film is unknown. But the current status for this HTF puppet movie is canceled. But why was it canceled? Because of research reasons. So therefore, there was no point of even making this movie at all. But like I said, this can still somewhat exist if... They canceled that one, but I'm not trying to get into some issues with Mondo Media, so I'm going to leave that as canceled. So let's move on to the next one. So for the last canceled project for like episodes or other media that I'll cover up next is part two to an episode I was doing back in June. I was supposed to release this by July or the end of August, or at least the middle of August. 
This was Angry Birds Amazing Adventures Season 5, Episode 5, An Old Foe, Part 2. And I do, I did just delete the post, like the community post, but I did promise that Saber Spark and Tommy NFG were going to be coupled. Well, no, 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 no. They're, they're going to make a couple of cameos, let's just say. Like they're probably going to be in the background somewhere. And as predicted, once the birds would beat Ray and the other Hungry Birds in this episode, at least appeared, Ray would actually get defeated, drop a black number with, like, it was the number 10,000. It would be colored black, and he would drop a skull. It was called the Skull of Hatred. Since he has a burning hatred for Red and his friends. Yeah, it was a lot like the Vengeance of Carnet, you know, the ingredient that Neither Flower dropped in Fantastic Adventure. It was like Red's first flight part two. Like I said, this episode was a lot like that episode. I've been losing a lot of motivation. The episodes weren't that well edited, so that's why this episode and the whole series as a whole is ended. So, there's that going for it. This is probably the canceled project I had the longest explanation for. But let's move on to some Wattpad stories that I had in mind. All right, so I had these two Wattpad stories in mind. They were called Beyond the Western Regions and Detective Reyes or whatever. But like I said, these would sound too boring once they were finished. Plus, I didn't have enough resources to make them. Even if I had enough resources, like I said, it would just be too boring and I'll get bored of making these easily, so they were scrapped for that reason alone. So, let's just move on. Another story that I had in mind was Ghost Force. Like, like a Ghost Force story. Originally, I was going to do a Wattpad story focusing on Ghost Force. You, you want to know something about Ghost Force? Did you know that the people who made Miraculous were behind Ghost Force and Zack Storm? Which I'll get to a Wattpad story based around that for a minute. Well, at least in a minute. That'll be next, I promise. But the reason that I cancel it, it's because I have almost no knowledge of Ghost Force at all. I have more knowledge of Miraculous than Ghost Force. Plus, plus that show was getting more love than Ghost Force and Zack Storm combined. And it wasn't even that close. So, those two stories are canceled, but I'll move on over to Zack Storm in a minute, as well as a little crossover between that and Miraculous Fantasy World. Yeah, like I said, I'm still working on the stories for the Miraculous Fantasy World series as I'm doing this video. This is because, well... That's the thing. I have other creative ideas for a Wattpad story. I was going to do a Nintendo High one. I was going to do one focusing on Sheriff Woody and all that. I think I announced these, but like, again, like I said, I want to do that and to creative ideas that aren't a part of the main paradox at all. So, that Wattpad story was scrapped. But this also, like I said, when it comes to cancel Wattpad story ideas, these do have a chance on coming back. You know, I have an idea, but I'll explain it by the end of the video. All right. So as I mentioned with Ghost Force, Zack Storm was going to get a Wattpad story. Like, I was thinking it was possible. But just like with Ghost Force, I had almost no knowledge with Zack Storm at all. I just heard of it because it was made by the same people who made Miraculous Ladybug. So, this gave me an idea. But like I said, due to me having almost no knowledge. Plus, I probably would have got bored after, like, halfway making the story, bro. Like, I was only, like, 30% there with this story. With Ghost Force, I was, like, 20% there. And, like I said, I was going to cross over with 
miraculous fantasy world in a way, but like I said, I don't know how to execute that crossover. So instead of giving the crossover story a separate part in the video, I'm gonna mention it here. But it's fine. Because like I said, the Zack Storm story and the Ghost Four story are still possible for the paradox. Like I might have those be spin-offs given they're made by the same, you know, people. So I think it's gonna cover everything for at least the cancel projects I have in this video. So I guess I'll see you all in the next video.